In this video, we will understand what are the different ways available for a user if he has forgot the password. Now, I am trying to log in with my username and password and I have forget the password. If I try to log in, it will give me a warning message. Now, I can click on forget password, specify the username and put in the store code for which I already have access. Now, if I click on send reset link, it will send me a link on my email ID and the telephone number. Now, there may be a scenario in which the telephone number or the email ID I have provided in user configuration is incorrect or maybe I do not have access to this mobile number or the email ID. In this scenario, a user have to reach out to his super admin and ask him to reset his password. So, super admin will log in to the control panel of users by going through admin user information. Then he can click on the username and initiate a password reset link. This way, a password reset link has been sent by using super admin credentials. Now, by taking the previous example, if the telephone number or the email ID needs to be changed for a user, as I said, maybe I do, maybe the user do not have access to the mobile number or the email ID. He has uh, changed the mobile number or he has changed his email ID or he do not have access to that email ID. A super administrator can come on this screen, modify the telephone number, modify the email ID, click on save and then he can, let me just do it. I am changing the mobile number and I am changing the email ID. Now, if I click on save and then once again open this user and resend the verification email, now the verification email with a password reset link has been sent to a new mobile number and new email ID. Let us just check how to reset the password with that email. This is the email I have received. Now I can click on the link and specify a new password. Password do not match. Maybe I did some typing mistake. Now I can log in with my username and password. Just to summarize, a user can initiate a password reset link by using the forget password link. This forget password link will send a code to reset the password on the email ID and the phone number. Now, in some scenario, the user may not have access to the email ID and the mobile number. So he need to contact his super admin and the super administrator can edit a user, modify the mobile number, modify the email ID, save the user, then once again edit the user and this time send the password reset link on the newly defined or edited mobile number and the email ID. This way, Either a user can reset his password or an administrator can change the detail of users and resend the link for resetting the password. Thank you.